talking about the different variables in an experiment. And first, I'm just going to start with some basic definitions of the different types of variables. And then we're going to gain a deeper understanding by looking at the reasons we classify the different variables the way we do. And then towards the end of the class, we're going to apply what we've learned by actually identifying each of these variables in some examples of real science experiments. So, to start off with, does anybody here know what a variable is? Yes, ma'am. It's something that changes. That's right, it's something that changes. What kind of things can we change in an experiment? Yes, ma'am. One um, time my mom was trying to figure out how to water her plants better, so she changed the amount of water. She changed the amount of water, right. So an experiment is a factor or a trait that can change in an experiment, and it can change in the type or the amount. So your mom changed the amount of water that she added to the plants, but you could also change what you're adding to the plants. So you could add water or coke to the plants and see how that affects the plants, right? Um, so there's actually three different types of variables in an experiment. Um, and the first one that we're going to talk about is a control variable. And the second one is something that we call an independent variable. And the last one is something that we call a dependent variable. So as I begin my explanation, I'm going to use a little bit of simple math to help explain this. I want you all to think about what I'm doing and think about what you know about each of these words. All right? So if I write, I'm going to write a math problem on the board, and I want y'all to tell me um, what the answer to the problem is. Does anybody know the answer to this problem? No. No, I see shaking heads. Are we missing something? Yeah, yeah we're missing a number, right? So we need a number in order to find the answer to this problem. Someone give me a number to fill in the blank. A hundred! A hundred! That's a good number. Nice even. And so if I add a hundred to these four numbers, what do I get to put in this blank? Yes, ma'am. 125. 125. Perfect. So can someone else give me a different number to add in the blank? Yes. Five. Five. So if I add five in, then what is my answer to the problem? Thirty. Thirty. That's right. So if one color set of these numbers is the controlled variable, which set do you think it would be? Yes. Black. Black. That's right. These black numbers stay the same throughout both of the problems. And in any kind of science experiment, all of your variables are going to remain the same for consistency except for one. So which, what, which of these numbers is something that depends on another number? One. The blue one, that's right. So our answer here on the end depends on whatever number we put in this blank, right? So this is our dependent variable. So here we have our control variables, which are controlled, they remain the same. And here we have our dependent variable, which changes based on our independent variable. And your independent variable is something that you change to find out the difference that you're making. So this is like when Anna was talking about her mom watering the plants, the independent variable would be the amount of water that she added because she wanted to know how the amount of water she added affected the way the plants grew. And so the way the, way the plants grew would be her dependent variable, because that's what she's measuring, that's what she wants to know. And everything else would have been a constant if her mom was running an experiment. Um, the pot size, the plant, the soil type, everything else would have remained constant. So to help y'all remember these different types of variables, I wrote a little song. Do y'all think y'all can sing it with me? Yeah. yeah. All right, I'm going to say each line, and then I want y'all to repeat after me, and then we'll do it once all together. To the tune of Shake It Off. You may recognize it. <laughs> <laughs> Your control variables stay the same, same, same. Your, Your control, control variables, variables stay the same, same, same. But the independent one, you change, change, change. But the independent one, you change, change, change. And the dependent one, you measure, measure, measure. And the dependent one, you measure, measure, measure. Experiment, 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 experiment. One, two, three. Your control variables stay the same, same, same. But the independent one, you change, change, change. And the dependent one, you measure, measure, measure. Experiment, experiment. Great job, everybody.